when I saw the images that have been floating all over the news all week, it became difficult to watch. The atrocious, degrading, demeaning, debauchery. I, I, I know who it was, but I saw my daughters and it made me angry. It made me angry. And I thought if, if it affected me like that as a man, how much more is that, that image a trigger for women who have been through that, who are currently going through that, who are in the middle of that, who feel trapped? Something you need to understand. If you got a rage you can't control, if you have an emotional problem, a mental health issue, where you're bipolar, you gotta get some help, dude. If you're into substance abuse and it turns you into a weapon, you gotta get some help. It triggered me as a father. I knew that wasn't my daughter's laying there, but it seemed like it was. I, I got mad, <laughs> like it was me. Men, we gotta care. When somebody kicks you and stomps you and beats you, it should, nobody, nobody deserves to be treated like that. It's gonna take us to stand up. It's gonna take us to speak out. It's gonna take us to say something. Until men start speaking up and saying enough is enough, there's not gonna be the change that we need.